Hey guys, it's Extreme 3D, and in this video, I will be reviewing Protopasta's carbon fiber filament. Stay tuned for more. Alright guys, so um, a while back, like a while, while back, uh, I said that I'd review this filament, and I finally have gone to print this because I've been very busy with other things, and I've got some really cool prints for you guys, and I'm going to show you these prints, and I'm going to tell you what I think about this filament. So um, first of all, this stuff is pretty darn brittle. Uh, I'll try to break a piece off right now. As you can see, it just broke off like that. There's no bending. It's very brittle, uh, but this filament is pretty pretty cool. You can do some really cool stuff with this. Let me try to get it to focus on this little piece. There you go. Uh, so this is really cool filament. It looks cool. It prints well. And I, it's so, it's so fun to print with. Um, and it's just really, it's really nice filament. It's really high quality filament. Uh, the spool is really nice also because it's just cardboard so you can recycle and everything. And uh, yeah, so uh, the print temperatures for this, um, you can, it's just regular PLA temperature. I printed this like it was just regular PLA and that seemed to work. So anywhere from like 200 degrees Celsius to 230 degrees Celsius would work. Uh, you don't need a heated bed, but if you want to put one on, you can do that too. So I'm going to show you some cool prints I did. So this is a little uh, drone. Uh, it's a like drone, I guess. It's like the, what, what do you call it? It's the carriage for the drone, I guess. It's the, it's the frame of the drone. Uh, so this is, you can, uh, I just found this off Thingiverse because I really wanted to print a, a drone frame uh, out of carbon fiber filament. So I found this and you can buy some parts for this if you want and you can actually, uh, you can make a drone with this stuff. So this stuff is pretty cool. I haven't tested the durability of it yet, uh, but I'd imagine it's kind of similar to PLA. Maybe breaks a little bit easier though, because it seems to be a little bit brittle. So now the next thing I'm going to show you is uh, it's Darth Vader, and uh, this is pretty cool. As you can see, it's like low poly Darth Vader. And here, let me get it focus. There you go. So it came out really well. And uh, I think it's a really cool print. Uh, the stuff is a little bit brittle though. Uh, also, you can see it messed up a little bit at the bottom. So that was a pretty cool print. Next thing I did was a 3D Benchy. Uh, this is the first time I've ever done a 3D Benchy with uh, exotic filament. I just wanted to test it out and as you can see, there have been some issues at the top for both of them. Uh, let me try to focus that. Uh, you can see there are some holes there that shouldn't be there. Also, the side is a little bit messed up with the layers. Uh, but, I mean, I expected this because this is carbon fiber filament. It's not regular PLA. It doesn't cool the same way. Uh, this one was a little bit worse. But, um... Uh, this this stuff is still pretty cool, so I'm not sure if it's the best for printing like models like this, but it's cool for other things like this. So these are some like 12 millimeter extrusions, I believe, and uh, I I think these just look amazing. Uh, it's a pretty cool like normally these are metal, but I wanted to try this in carbon fiber. I printed two of them, and they look really nice. They look really cool, and uh, they seem to be pretty strong. Yeah, I can't bend it. I can't do anything of that like that. It seems like it'd take a lot of force to break these. And uh, this filament is really awesome. So if you're looking to print some really cool things like this, if you're looking to print like a drone uh, frame or anything else like that, this filament is the thing for you. This stuff is pretty cool. Um, like, I wouldn't use this regularly, but this is something that I'd use if I want to, you know, mix things up or have a little bit of fun, print some cool models with this stuff. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be my video for today. I'll see you guys next week. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. Subscribe if you're new. Like the video if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!